What's up guys so today we got the rsf 650 here and today we're going to be upgrading it with the 72 volt powertrain so 72 volt battery 72 volt controller 72 volt motor 72 volt throttle i will be getting a throttle soon a new throttle soon but yeah so i already have the hydraulic disc brakes i already have the rotors i already have the works in and those are the only upgrades so far like this one's brand new I, it works oh it's hitting wait one second see it works perfectly fine <clears throat> but we're going to be putting these 72 volt powertrain in it should go anywhere from 45 to 50 mile per hour depending on the gearing so <clears throat> I don't I'm think I'm gonna go like 45 because I want the torque to pop it up But if I just wanted to go fast no torque I could do 50 which and put like a 14 tooth I'm gonna put like a I'm, I don't know. Yeah, I'm gonna put a 13th or 11 tooth for this, but I think I'm gonna go 13 still torque and Still um fast, but yeah, let's get to it. So I got the 72 volt battery motor and controller and then the throttle and then I'm going to put these certain grips over that throttle. Just for now. <clears throat> and then I'm probably going to buy a certain throttle. And then three speed and all that. So, you. Yeah. Let's get to it. Oh, and then the motor has a heat sink for it. And But, yeah, that should be everything. So, I'm going to get to building. And um, if you guys haven't saw before, go to my last videos. It's me unboxing the bike. Me putting the brakes works and all that on the grips and stuff so yeah let's get to building now you guys are probably waiting so let's get to it <laughs> want to keep the motor you would do that and um it's just a little tip but i got it all stripped down to the frame got the 72 volt parts and i'm gonna start putting them in i was test fitting the battery too but let's do it <laughs>
Alright guys, I'm on the Razer RSF 650. 70, fully 72 volts. Okay. It's fully charged, so it's 83.5 volts right now. I'm gonna let this car pass. I'm in mode one, okay? And it's torquey. And I have a 13 tooth. Ready? Yo! This is broken! Yo! Oh my god! This is mode one! Ain't no way. How? And it's a lot lighter. So, guys, let's put the speedometer app on in mode one and see what that does. So, there's always an ad, so. We have to give it a few seconds. Okay, there's an ad. Wait five seconds and then we'll go. This thing is so fast. Okay, the app's on, it's at one mile per hour. So, dang, it wants to pop up and when I go in the grass, it just wants to burn rubber. Ready? Let's go see! 72 volts, baby! Mod 1, guys! Yo! This is Mod 1! Yo! Okay. Let's see how fast that was. Okay, guys. 31 miles per hour in mode 1. 31 miles per hour in mode 1. That is crazy. Okay, guys, let's go try mode 2. Guys, so I think I'm going to amp it up into mode 2. Ready? Yo. Yo. Yo, that is way too fast, bro. I couldn't even go fully because there's a car right there. Oops. <laughs> I almost popped. I almost looped it. Good thing I was holding the brake down. Dang, I gotta take off in mode one. Alright, guys. Let's go back in mode two. Ready? What's that fast, baby? This is fast. I don't even know how fast. you guys think that was I I'm I'm never going back in mode two let's check it 38 I wasn't even fully that's mode two and I wasn't I let off because the street ended I'm scared to go into mode three I don't even think I am it's a sleeper build it looks completely stuck, but they don't know that I got that 72 volts. Okay guys, it's getting dark and I don't have no lights. So I'm gonna wait till tomorrow to do top uh, speed test in, in mode three. Well, I'm just gonna go in mode two, mode one and two. But look, why is he going so slow? Messing up my sound. But ready guys, look it. I have neutral, so that's dope. Okay, I'm gonna go. This thing just wants to pop up. Mo two. Look at this thing! Yo! Oh my god, 
god, god. You could tell like the big difference from mode one and two. Yo. Dang. Shouldn't even be on the sidewalk. I'm in mode one and I'm running. All right, I need to slow down. I need to slow down. I'm just gliding. I'm not even pressing the brakes. I'm not even pressing the throttles. There goes the throttle. You guys can hear it. Sheesh. This bike is crazy. Okay. 38. Sheesh. Dang, that's fast. Okay, I'm gonna put my phone back in my pocket. Keep going. I'm gonna try to do top speed run on mode two. So I'm gonna go over there, do a U turn, tuck, and go all the way to the end, okay, guys? Okay, ready, guys? One, two, three. are gonna be burnt so I'm gonna go back and move one slow down on its own because I don't want to use the brake. Brakes too much. Okay. Okay guys. Let's see how fast that was. 40! No way! I hit 40! Yo, 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 and it has more. Yo. <laughs> that is crazy! Alright, what's up guys? Just got back from the ride and this bike is so nice. It handles amazing. I turn it on 82 volts and like I'm gonna do it in neutral. You see? <clears throat> Super nice. It has so much torque. I went 40 miles per hour in mode two and it was getting dark so I didn't want to go that much faster. But yeah, so what I did was I put off camera I put these Phase wire covers uh, over all the wires and brake lines made it look really nice. And look, it I still have a ton of space in here because I didn't mess with nothing. Like my goggles still fit, my my gloves will fit, my phone, all of that will fit. So then I put the controller in here, let all the wires down in here. Then I put the batteries right there, and then the motor right there. So the bike's not completely done yet. I still need to cut the brackets off the motor and then put the heat sink on. Then put a new grip, a new throttle because it's mismatched. But for now, it's working nice. And yeah, the only thing I didn't film was I had to countersink the screws with the motor. So the screws in the back since it's a Vevor motor, you have to take them, take one out of at a time. So you have to, I take one out, drill it, uh, hole in with the drill bit where it was and then I have to make sure it's smooth with the back piece of the motor and I did that worked good but yeah so oh and then I got the, the forks match it really nice the forks that Saronster gave me the zoom brakes feel nice and got Saronster's ride charge repeat keychain but yeah so I'm gonna put 
So I'm writing for the job. The video's not too long. If the video is long, stay tuned for next week. It'll be in there. But yeah. Thank you guys for watching and stay tuned. One of the most terrifying pieces of machinery ever made.